Well, welcome. Today I get the opportunity to take you through a brand new one Ascendant 110, and let's walk in to the cab. So we came up, got this beautiful one, uh, ten, uh, 110 Ascendant Enforcer cab, came back up with it, so it has great compartmentalization with six-person cab. Let's walk you through the inside. So we went with the 911 seats, amazing seats, nice open cab space, and gives you good ergonomics for all of our uh, firefighters' needs. Let's take you back in the back side. Come on up here. So we got great EMT cabinets or great accessibility. Easy maneuverability for all four firefighters in this area. Got plug-ins to the back, to the front. Got all lit up areas inside of this thing so we can get the cabs lit up. SCBA compartments within the seats. Gives great ergonomics to get out. Additional side railings to come out this side. This is where it's amazing portion. We also went with the puck. Uh, so the Pierce Ultimate configuration gives us the ability to get our firefighters ergonomic safety for hose handling, get it off onto their shoulders without any uh, unwanted risk to uh, any personnel for fire systems. We went with the 1500 Pierce uh, pump and we also have the Husky Pro system into it for foam. Amazing system, we've been really happy with this setup. So I want to take you through all the compartments on this truck. From here, we've got all the ability to put up equipment charging from shore power to also generator power on scene. Fully laid up doors, all uh, accessibility, maneuverable, shelv maneuverable shelving. From here we continue. This was one of the biggest things that drew us to this unit, the amount of storage. Complete maneuverable shelving here and through the next ones. We've also got SCBA holding devices two units per side. Coming to the back here, look at the size of this unit. We can got pull out tra shelving trays, 500 pound capacity, movable shelf on the top, more charging units here. Okay, keep walking around the back side. Even more compartments in here with ladders. Easy ergonomics to get this thing off. And top hose compartments on the top. And we can knit both the two and a half and high ball hose. Even more hose or storage compartments on this side. All of our main platform capabilities. Come on to this. More shelving here. Again, all lit up so we can uh, put shore power or generator power onto this unit. And it just keeps going. From here we even have pull out trays pegboard so we can actually put it on any of our equipment on the back side or front side. This gives us full capability on this unit as a complete platform and yet single axle. For us in the volunteer or paid on call, that's a huge aspect. We can maintain our fire fleet so we don't have to go with class 3 uh, licenses and still maintain all of the storage compartment needs that we need to. More polo trays here, adjustable shelving up top and continues, just continues. 200 foot extension reel uh, fully powered with all adjustable trays again. Backside, we can pull out the compartments on either side, two and a half and 44 mil units. Takes up to the right to the front of the unit, and we can take you up to the top of the platform. Gives us 110 feet to the very top, gives us that three person capability. Again, all this on a single axle unit. That gives us all the support we can help and uh, need for all of our personnel and, and maintaining a nice 10,000 person community and a full capability of not just looking at it in a quint but going up to this platform. We're the fortunate group to be able to support this into Canada as the first platform on single axle brought in by the Ascendant 110. We'd like to thank Pierce and thank all the assistance they've done for us. We would definitely choose to purchase through this company for every unit you can. Thanks very much.